Hello, my name is Joe Stander. Now that AP 800 is winding down, I am now given the opportunity to reflect on all that I have done for this class. Not only reflect, mind you, but to discuss how each assignment has helped in my professional growth and to my desire to become a building administrator. And let me tell you, my desire has been peaked and I have grown during this short time throughout this course. I have learned that it is important to join new communities and to admit your own weaknesses so you can improve on them as well as the importance of getting to know those within a digital and physical community so I can build relationships to better help students and the education system. I also learned that to have a great technology plan, I must have a strong vision that relies on input from the schools, parents, and stakeholders. Without a strong vision, then we will fail in advancing technology. Along with advancing technology, I have grown to understand that we must stay up to date on new and emerging technology and with that, we must learn how to better help our students be prepared with skills that will benefit them in the 21st century. It is also important that staff learn and explore what new technology and different pedagogy. My eyes have been open to many challenges that face us as we advance technology. I learned that I must actively think about how I can help students and staff that suffer due to the digital divide. I must do away with the status quo and think differently when it comes to technology in the classroom and exactly what a classroom should look like. Though technology is important, it is the people that drive it. Whether it is my staff, board members, stakeholders, or digital community, I must always be open to receiving feedback about my ideas, and I must always remember that I should always be giving feedback when any one of my staff offers their ideas. I must be able to highlight what works well and what should be improved on. Because if my staff wants to try something new, I want them to know that they can come to me and share their ideas and know that it is okay to try something new and different without feeling like a failure. Throughout these modules, I was introduced to a new piece of technology that I feel will help with communication, screencast matic lucid charts, and pictograph. As I continue to develop as an administrator, I must be open to trying new technology. Though I might not be a professional at using all of these technologies that is developed, I must continue learning and expanding my horizons with the use of technology. When I lead by modeling, my staff will be more open to trying new things, and so will my students. My understanding of the digital citizen blossomed during this short months. <clears throat> I know that as an administrator, it is important for my students to learn how to use technology appropriately and effectively. Students should learn while they are young so they can be better prepared to be righteous digital citizens. My idea of the scope in technology needs to be used to grow during this time. There are many aspects of new technology that can change learning, teaching, and leading. I've also learned that we should always be looking for better ways to change how we do assessments and how our infrastructure is made strong. With technology comes a new way of thinking. We must get away from what schools used to be and design it to fit a 21st century. I learned a lot during this class, but the most important lessons I learned was always have a strong vision, always try new technology.